hello everyone welcome back to my channel and welcome to the winter formal vlog i am so excited about this video i've been looking forward to making and editing this video for months i don't know if you can hear or not but my voice is gone because of screaming so loudly at the game and the basketball game the night before but i'm excited to bring you guys this video it was a little jumbled the day of the dance so i'm gonna be narrating it for you guys and i want to thank lulu's for sponsoring today's video also the lighting is a little whack because the clouds i'm in my brother's room by the way which you don't see very often because he's away at college and Anyway, back to what I was saying. I want to thank Lulu's for sponsoring this video. I've been a shopper and fan of Lulu's for a very long time. I've seen them all over Instagram. I see all my favorite bloggers posting about them. So for me to be working with them is so surreal. And I'm so excited. And I was going to put this in a different video, but I thought it's all about like prom and school dances. So what better video to put it in than this one? They sent me a whole bunch of prom dresses and accessories. And I'm going to try them on before I talk about the winter formal stuff and have you guys help me decide what to wear for prom. That's in April. So that's a little ways away, but you got to start early because stuff runs out of stock so this box has been sitting in my room for like a week and a half and it's been killing me not to open it before i open anything up i want to let you guys know you can shop all the products down below in the description box through magic links here we go first thing are these pretty hoop earrings and i wore these um the morning of formal so you'll see that and i want to wear these to prom as well this ring set oh my gosh these are beautiful they lace up like this i'll put a picture on the screen from the website you gotta be joking the clear detail thank you to lulu's for sending me all this stuff this is unbelievable real one more dress in here i love this color i wore a dress that was similar to this color uh for winter formal last year insert photo here also i picked out this bag from their website because i don't have a bag that i feel like works well for like weekend trips like i don't have a good duffel bag and now i do look at this it could go with anything even just like if you're going to get ready at someone else's house you can throw all your crap in a bag like this and it holds everything so perfectly and there's zippers and little compartments on the inside i should have said this earlier but if you are unaware lulu's is a a digitally native fashion brand focused on delivering affordable luxury to young women they don't just have prom dresses and fancy clothes they have all kinds of looks from head to toe all over their website that will fit everyone's needs from like dressier to more casual styles so let's do this i'm gonna put on this green one first this is small here's what it looks like on their website on the model beautiful and you're about to see it on me are you ready here is dress number one the slits what do we think? This is very much a top contender. First thoughts, I love the fabric. This is like open back situation. Adjustable straps. I'm gonna put these ones on with this because I like the lace up one for the other dresses. This is so pretty. I love this, wow. It got really bright outside, but next is gonna be the pink. Let me like unveil it first so we can all react to it together. This is like a classic straight neck. I think it has a slit. I don't know actually. Yes, it does. It has a slit right here. Okay, it's time. Bye, this is very sideways. I'm too frazzled. Okay, here we go. Guys, this one is also very much up there. The slit it comes up really high. I have shorts on right now. It's like a princess. Let me show you from a different angle. Hold up, I need to put these heels on. They're still in their packaging. Look at the back. Oh. What do we think? What do we think? Moment for the shoes. The slit being high does worry me for my uh, private school self a little bit, but it's so fun. I'm a fan. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. This is like princessy for sure though. Moving on, last and final dress is the burgundy one. I honestly forget what this looks like. So we're gonna find out together. It has polka dots on it though. Okay, I do remember. I don't think I've worn a burgundy dress for a dance either. Okay, last one, here we go. Okay, ready? With the shoes, you guys. I can't even go to full length one. There we go, that's the angle I wanted. I wanted you guys to see the tears on this. This gives me more ball gown type vibes than prom vibes, if you know what I'm saying. But I wanted to try one on with tears. I think this one fits the best though. The zipper comes up higher than the others, which I really like. So now I needed your guys' help to tell me which one is your favorite. Let me know in the comments below. Also, which pair of shoes you like better. I like the ones that um, lace up and tie the best because I was gonna order them for winter formal. I actually put them in this collage before I even knew I was working with Lulu's this month, so that's really cool. I'm gonna put it back on my sweater because I think that's it for this portion of the vlog. Thank you again to Lulu's for sponsoring. This makes me so excited for prom. It'll be my first one. I was gonna go my freshman year because my school, my freshman year, allowed us to go to prom, but now only juniors and seniors get to go to prom. So it's my first one. I can't wait. And let me know in the comments your favorite one. Update, I just took a break from filming so I could finish my math let me get the audio going again hold on that's better okay so basically on the morning of winter formal i had plans to vlog all day long but those got a little messed up because my batteries died or i forgot my camera or i left it places or it was just honestly such a crazy day there was so much going on and i feel like i didn't have a single free moment until we got to pictures because it was just go 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 the whole time so um my day started off with me getting up to take the act and this is where the vlog was going steady so i'll insert that footage here hello everyone good morning welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's video it is a very exciting one today's video is going to be all about winter formal it's a packed 
day. I have what I'm about to do right now, which I'll explain in a second. Then I'm going to get our flowers. From the flower shop, the sun is rising, so the lighting is eh, but just work with me. I also have a Celsius because it's going to be such a long day. I haven't had one of these in a long time because I feel like they make me break out, but today, this is a must. So after I get the flowers, I'm going to my hair appointment at Dry Bar. Grace and I have an appointment at the same time, so that'll be fun. And then from there, we're going to Chloe's house to get ready and then two pictures, dinner, the dance, and then my house for the after party. So I'm so pumped. Allie's parked right next to me because we're about to go take the ACT. Woo! It's 8 a.m., 7.43 right now. I have everything I need in my fanny pack. My little ticket thingy, my pencils, my calculator. I didn't do a lot of prep for this because I kind of want it to be like a baseline thing and then I'll go from there. I probably should have done more, but I just, I don't know. It didn't make sense to me because I want to prep off of what I score, if that makes sense. I look like an egg because I have been trying to leave my hair like unwashed. You cannot see me at all. Basically, it's oily as heck right now. And then my dress is hanging back here and I'm so pumped. Let's check in with Allie. Good morning. Another Allie day, has an even longer. Sleigh. Another day. Another I gotta go because obviously I can't vlog in the testing room. So I'm actually gonna put you back in my car and I'll update you in three very long hours. Okay. Peace out. Okay, after the ACT, I rushed to go pick up the flowers. I think I did okay in it. Obviously, I'm not allowed to um, discuss anything about the test. Like legally, you have to sign stuff about that. So I can't say anything about that. But as for my performance, I felt like okay about it. But I think I talked about this in the vlog. It was in my baseline. I haven't done really a lot of prep for it. That's that. I thought there were four tests on the ACT though. Like I... For some reason, I knew it was math, uh, reading, English, and science, but I didn't know there was a fifth test, which is a random one that they throw in at the end. That could be any of the four. For, I just, that's because I didn't do any prep. I just didn't really know what I should have known. So I was hyping myself up before I finished. Like, this is my fourth test. I got this. I'm so close to being done. Like, it's gonna be such a fun day once I'm done because my brain was just dying out at this point. And the proctor was like, close your books and prepare for test five. And I was like, <laughs> what? So that was alarming, um, very disappointing that there was a fifth test, but I made it through. It was not fun at all, but luckily I did take on a day where there was a lot of fun like happening afterwards. So I had something to look forward to. Even just like going home and taking a nap would be something to look forward to enough. But after I got out of the test, I literally felt like my head was spinning because I drove so fast to the flower place to pick up the flowers before they closed. I was so nervous that I wasn't gonna make it because again, I thought there was four tests and I kept looking at the clock and I was like, okay, I'm done. Like once I'm done with this test, I can go, I'll be fine. And then when he said test five, I realized how short I was on time that I was gonna be late to the hair appointment and everything like that. So I rushed to get the flowers. I took a clip of those. I was a little worried about the ribbon being the wrong color, but it ended up being fine. I was just freaking out because once again, my head was spinning. I had just taken that test. And then I went to get my car go back home and my grandpa took me from my house to my hair appointment and then grace's mom took me and grace from the hair appointment to chloe's house to get ready and at this point i had no idea where my camera was i was losing my crap because i was like this bag with my camera in it my keys in it like basically the little bag i was carrying with me because everything else was in a bigger department store bag like my dress my shoes and whatever else and i was like this bag i left it at dry bar like i left it at the hair place i was freaking out luckily i had just left it in grace's car but i obviously couldn't vlog anything because it was in there so then we just jumped straight to pictures in the next clip but basically we got ready at chloe's house because they i was later to the hair appointment they took us a little bit later and then we were a lot shorter on time at chloe's that was very very stressful i tried to make tiktoks i started some this should be way closer to me sorry about that um i started some tiktoks Never finish them, unfortunately. Here's all the clips from pictures. And then at this point, it started to get a little more fluid with the vlogging. So I don't have to update you for a little while. Oh, We're out friend. here. <laughs> Blake. <laughs> um, Katie hasn't vlogged at all, she says, because like she didn't right? want to and she hates you guys. <laughs> so that's why that happened. Um, Matt looks really good. <laughs> What's up, vlogs? Oh, I was 20 minutes late here, and then I, I went to the wrong lake because I'm dumb, and then I was supposed to take 15 minutes to get here, and I got here nine. Here's Kira. Hi! And we're taking lots and lots that, of dude. photos. Oh, yeah. So, that. This is Johnny. Hi, I'm Johnny. My wonderful date. I'm her date. All of you know me very well. How much was the camera? Oh, it's my fourth one. Oh my god. She breaks oh all of them. That reminds me of George. The lighting's pretty good. Football. Is it recording? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get that out of the way. Let's go, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh. Let's go. 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 Let's go.
It's Macy. We're in the parking lot. We are at the function. Our friendship was like a very, very. We're not at the function. We're at pictures. We're at thumbnail. Wait, should I set it down? Yeah. I don't. I set it. Boom. Okay, everybody step back. I'm supposed to be in this. Yes, get in it. Wait, fours? Yeah, fours. I did three. Wait. Perfect. Okay. okay guys, we are going to dinner right now. I don't know if Kasha told you, but I vlogged absolutely nothing because I left my camera like an idiot. So she hates you guys. Too that's much. really unfortunate and stop. I am going to picture or going to dinner. I'm so oh, sad I feel like all day. Oh, Kenneth, you want to be the There's Kenneth. I vlogged. One clip, one second. Right. We got it. We are in the car, the camera cut off, but I was saying that we we're going to dinner at this place on the lake. It is Mexican I'm very excited about it. We got Allison, Jonathan, <laughs> Cashton, and me. So talk to you when green. we get food. And I need to do a better job of vlogging tonight I because I, I got no footage. They want me. So they want pictures you. were fine. Actually, it took a full hour and a half because I won't say why, but it took a long time. Okay. We all know why it took a long time. These shoes are very heavy, but they are awesome, so it's okay. Yeah. I don't know where we're going, actually, but I think it's Mexican okay. food. Do you have something to say, Allison? To interrupt me? I have something to say. Pass it, pass it, pass it, pass it. One thing, one thing only. We look so much better than they did. They're Guys, they're comment they're who looks better, please. You look way better. Please. In the comments, you either write down either Cashton looks best or Cashton looks the best. Those are two options, and then we'll decide from there. Cashton knows it's right. Just kidding, but we actually look better because we have matching shoes, which you can't see. Yeah. Charlie and Claire behind us, and I think that's it for now. So we'll see you guys. Oh, yeah. later. <laughs> Oh, don't, don't you dare. I, so what? We did, so we paid the I whole vlogged, thing. Wait, stop. I we vlogged. did pay the whole thing in cash? I vlogged nothing at dinner. Did we actually? Yes, we did. Here Thankfully, here. everyone brought their cash, so we were able to pay the whole bill in. I figured cash. it out. She didn't. She failed. So I took over. I have redone this clip like four or five times, but we are finally leaving. The camera is having gosh, a lot of so issues so right good. now. We're going to be late for the dance, but it is what it is. Two for two. Come on. You got this. There you go. Okay. Anyways, we are going to the dance. Finally, Johnny is back there. This corsage is breaking, unfortunately. Yeah, Allie's also back there, I'm and there we will, the beer will be talk on. to you guys soon. I think oh, we are oh, going Trey. to- Trey. Shoot, what's his name? Come on, Johnny. Mullet. Trey. Trey. Trey's the boy. I freaking love Trey. Me too. Let's go, Trey. <laughs> Can you say that? Should we go now? I want to. We don't have to, but like- Let's just do it. Left at the light. Right at the line. You think they're gonna not let us get in? Like, come on. I don't know. Ask Katie. Katie's smarter. Okay, bye. There's too much going on right now. We made it. I got my head out this sunroof. I'm blasting my favorite tunes. I only got one thing on my mind. You got me stuck on the thought of you. You're making me feel brand new. You're more than a sunshine in my eyes. You got those pretty eyes. I'm back and that was the entirety of the dance a lot of people had my camera <laughs> it was getting passed around I had no idea where it was at one point so that was a little scary. I should probably be more careful with it, but it's so fun to pass it around and see from like everybody's perspective. The dance was a really good time. The DJ was okay, much better than our other dances, but we had a really fun time. It was like so many bodies though in the mosh pit, so sweaty. We were all exhausted. We were dying. So we went back to my house after the, <laughs> this is the clip I took in the car, by the way. We're exhausted. That's all you need to know. And we're going to my house. Bye. I don't know how Cash and drove and did not fall asleep at the wheel because we were done. We were gonna go get Red Bulls, but we didn't do that. I think we would have crashed though even more if we drank though, so it was probably a good thing. Anyway, then we went back to my house for the after party. I don't have a lot of footage from that. There's maybe two or three clips. Uh, hey, we're playing some Tay Tay up in here. It's your boy, Trey. With the Guys, they they that was fun. We ordered a whole bunch of pizza. Uh, we had the hot tub on, lots of people showed up. The next day I woke up, um, we ate a bunch of food at the house. My mom went and got us bagels, which was really nice. And and I have to shout out my mom for being 
the greatest person in the world. She helped me go like scout out a picture spot. She helped obviously throw the after party, ordered so much pizza, helped us find our dinner reservations, a place that would take all 32 of us, literally ridiculously sized group. So she is the best and she's so involved and I'm so grateful for her. Anyway, she got us breakfast and then everyone ended up leaving around 10-ish, which is kind of early considering how late we were all up. But then I went to math tutoring with Chloe and Sarah and Andrew. Andrew's mom tutors us, so it was nice. We were like all exhausted because we all were struggling. It wasn't just like one person. I drank a Celsius at their house and I tried to do what I could. I have a clip of that that I'll insert right here. And then I went to Matt's for the Super Bowl. I don't have any footage from that, but I think that's all for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to go shop all the stuff from Lulu's down below in the description box. I'm so excited to have these videos. I'm so grateful for all of your support that I'm able to work with brands and able to get this content for you guys that I can look back on one day. I had so much fun at the stance, so much fun this weekend, even though I'm exhausted. I have to turn around and go get ready right now for uh, basketball match with Chira. And I have a math quiz tomorrow and I have to memorize like 20 something formulas. I just had no idea. They're just gone out of my brain. And I have missing math assignments too. So I gotta go. I'll talk to you in my next video. And don't forget to like, subscribe, go follow me on TikTok, Instagram, everywhere you can find me. Lots of platforms. And I will see you soon. Gotta go. Bye. I'm sorry. People are yelling at me. So. My flag has been on this whole time. I was in that video. <laughs> That's the video. We are back in the car. We were never in the car in the first place. Let me redo this clip. <laughs> Can you tell them that I haven't vlogged anything since I forgot my camera? Um, no. My toes are out. It's terrible. I didn't think I was recording, but I fully was. And I was editing the video and I watched it back and I was like, You guys good? Bye. Did we forget Sarah? It's a right, Allie. Allison, I, I know you think you're no, smarter than No, I'm telling Trey. This is in front of us. Katie, we're waiting on you. Why? It's coming out